One and one in his uh, professional career. He's a Levittown, New York native. Long Island, red. Controlling the middle of the ring right now. Seeing what he has. Throwing some leg kicks, front leg kicks, trying to control the ring. In the ring with the pink gloves. I mean, he just looks physically much stronger than his opponent in this fight. Much stronger. Oh, indeed. Leg kick, leg sweep by McGroom. But he does actually have McGroom right against the ropes. Are you trying to work that jab? Ooh, nice sweep. Ooh. Power punch by McGroom. And he tried to throw power punch back at him. Body shot by McGroom. He's looking at him like, what are you trying here? Are you connected with a right on me, Ooh, combination by McGee. Body. Yeah. 
He was watching. Uh, McBroom is in the white and black shorts. Remember, Tariq is in uh, the red shorts. Remember, you can listen to the show right now live. Errol Marks, Kyle Tao, Cage Den and May here with our special guest, our co-host, Larry. Oh, McBroom hits him with a big left. Well, Jesse's going to knock his block off. I, I mean, I see, I've seen this man work. I've seen him work for years now. Utilizing the knee. On the left. He he's shaking his head, running. saying that he's not going. He's shaking it off, but... This is for the professional K-1 championship here, our co-main event of the evening. Solid round in the first round. I mean, he landed some solid shots, but you know, Tyreek, uh, he didn't back down. He threw some uh, pretty good shots as well. Well, a lot of ways, gentlemen, this is the co-main event, but this is the last out. So, this is the last to get pressure of the uh, last round that a lot of these fans are going to walk away with. English bread, Lincoln bread, unbelievable fight we just watched. I enjoyed one of them. Let's do one. It's not good for you, but I it makes a delicious sandwich. I like whole wheat. I like it toasted. A to- yeah, the, a little butter. I like the you multi- yeah, you're talking about talk now, Kyle. I like the multi. Multi grain is good for you. Good I, I love bread in general. I do too. I'm like Oprah. I love bread. <laughs> <laughs> I do not know Oprah loves bread, but that's a good fact. Have you haven't seen those ads? No, I haven't. Oh my gosh, <laughs> I've seen the Got Milk bands. <laughs> Big knee by McBroom. See if he can sweep him up. He trying to control the middle of the ring. He's pushing him behind. Giving a warning. I don't know what happened. He tried to get his chin back. I think he was told to stop and uh, do a last second shot. Kind of connected with the champ. The heat throwing jabs, backing up the groom, a combination to the body. The groom can't go. Heard that? Showing I had you. Showing him right there I had you. Boom, throwing the body kick. Can we check in the picks though? This is a lot closer fight than anybody thinks. This is a five round bout, ladies and gentlemen. We're in round two. Oh, knee by McCoy. Knee again by McCoy. Knee again by McCoy. The groom looks a little tired. He's dancing to the ropes. He got him against the ropes right now. Throwing some combinations. The groom is not blocking. He keeps throwing this jab. The groom is not blocking. He's landing. Oh, big shot to the ropes. Oh, 
Diamond's busy? Well, she's, she's, back. she's with my friend Giovanni. There you go. Black Diamond is still here. Is that her nickname, Larry? I like, I like to call her Diamond just for shorter. Okay. Tina. You know, riding around with that Tina. Oh, oh man. He's not really opening up, though. He's keeping his elbow to right to his side. He's not protecting himself. The Heat is throwing some nice freaking combinations. Body shots by McBroom. Great fight so far between these two athletes. Uppercut by McBroom. Body shots. Knee to uh, knee from uh, McBroom to, uh, to Mahee. Mahee thrown combinations against the ropes. Up oh, the big left by uh, McBroom. Knee from McBroom. There's a lot of stuff going on. They're not backing out. They're shaking each other's heads. They're not quitting. Oh, wow. What a left by McBroom. Everyone's about to start laying in that heavy thunder. I wonder sometimes when these fighters shake their head like it's not hurting. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a big, big thing. Axel kick. Axel kick on the ground for the back of the 
drop him right to the canvas. And Jesse's not showing any signs now of being groggy. Uh, I think the confidence just went up after that kick. Trying to squeeze the crew, the crew fine slow. The crew getting to the body. Uppercut by the crew. Mahid hasn't hit the ropes. Not blocking Mahid, he's letting him landing. That's because he's keeping his uh, left oh, hand yeah. up. Uppercut by the crew. Landed by Mahid. Counter punch. Trying to sweep Mahid. Red corner is wearing the pink gloves. The blue corner is wearing the green gloves. Ten seconds left in the fourth, and five, uh, fourth round. I'll tell you this: McGroom has landed all the power punches. My heat is landed. For yeah, his volume is a lot higher, but his accuracy and power behind the significant strike isn't even there compared to me. I agree on that. Good, then I was gonna beat you up if you did it. Yeah, good luck with that. Alright, we're going into our fifth round here. Final. Look at the over there. Does a great job at hitting and turning his opponent. Oh, yeah, to some shots. I know it again by McGroom. He knows his position in that ball. ring. Chest, body shot after body shot by McGroom. He is tired. He is tired. Yeah, but really, he's not giving up by giving a lot of props. He's just pushing forward. Jesse just keeps moving. Power after power after power. This is a title bout. Flying knee. Jesse, you wanted to end it right there, I know it. Keep trying to push him off, trying to keep him away. Not the last of us goes round. Doing some combinations to the face. The groom is not blocking him. He's absolutely not That's just going to affect him on the scorecard. That's right. Body shot by the game. Ten seconds left in the bout. Ten seconds for the last round. Big hit. Yeah. That's the ball game, ladies and gentlemen. That was McCroom's I think that was McCroom's fight, quite frankly. Tariq, Tariq, he, he, he was hanging tough. But uh, Jesse was laying in that heavy artillery. He's got some strong, strong, thunderous blows in there. I think, quite frankly, he was trying to end it with that flying knee. Fantastic fight. Fantastic fight. Bobby Campbell, last fight. Chris Deacon, last fight. Wonderful. Wonderful. Back there. Radio. Remember, ladies and gentlemen, you can go and 
Village people, village people, rich people, all over the place tonight. Remember, if you want to see great fights, eventbrite.com. Eventbrite.com. New York Fight Exchange. Yes. Every five rounds of the world of the circle. All three you join the score without in favor of your winner, by unanimous decision, and new Jackhammer Promotions, K1 195 pound champion, Bobby Ledford, Jesse Mikey Washington is about to leave. We had a great time, ladies and gentlemen. It was a great, great card. You guys can absolutely buy the DVD if you want to buy the DVD. I'm going to interview, actually. There we go. Jesse, I couldn't get one announcing you. I got a history. We do have a history, my brother. I couldn't get one announcing you the victor tonight, but. You know how I do this. How are you feeling after this one? Feeling good, bro. I want to give a shout out to Talk. He's my dude. I was supposed to fight for Florida for you. This kid stepped up on a two weeks notice and took the fight, so it's got to be here. Jesse, did you have any last bit of shout out to one of you gave any fake news you wanted to get to any of the people in attendance here tonight? Yeah, I want to give a shout out to all my uh, story of people that came out. My family at DOC, the Public Corrections, they were in the house, and I was fans from Ireland. Of course, my brother, Tim Baxter. Got the smile of life, big truck, and walking me out. All the boys, of course, and I know one fan, my wife. Without her, none of this is possible. I'm going to give a big shout to my trainer, Bobby Campbell. When I first started nine years ago, I was going to a center camp, and they wouldn't let me kickbox. Unless I was supervised, you know, whatever, whatever, I got it. And Bobby put me on my right way. Took me around America, around the world, and got a lot of fights. So congrats, man, I'm going to win. You know, Jesse, I couldn't have said it better myself. Thank you, Bobby Campbell. Thank you, Jack Hammer Promotions. When we're going to see you next competing in a ring, Jesse? Ready or cage, and I'm competing as a star. I just got one more thing to say. My two line, what the price is right. That's right, and the price is right for you to join us right back here at Mulcahy's for the next exciting Drive Hammer promotion event. Thank you for coming out, and everyone, drive home safe. I just want to let everybody know that you can follow us by going to www.sportsonthegrid.com. Remember, you can go to www.sportsonthegrid.com. Thank you, Mulcahy's. Thank you, everyone, for coming out for Jack Hammer Promotions. This is Jack Hammer Promotions. Bobby Campbell's last fight. I give a shout out to Bobby Campbell. Thank you, Shout out to Larry Legend. Hi, do you have anything to say before we go? No, it was a great event tonight. It was a pleasure working with Larry. I know he's still climbing out of the ring, but uh, Arrow for our first uh, live commentating event, I think it went pretty well. I hope everyone that was listening enjoyed it. Uh, like you said, a big thank you to Bobby Campbell and Jack Hammer Promotions and his uh, girlfriend, Teresa, for helping us out with uh, putting this together. And, uh, like we've said, if you're interested in purchasing the DVD, contact Bobby Campbell, Teresa, or, our, or us, 
Sports on the Go One dot com. Um, send us a message and uh, we'll get you a DVD. Larry, do you have anything to say before we go? All I gotta say is it has been my pleasure, my honor to be right here for Bobby Campbell's last round and to meet two new colleagues from behind the microphone. It's all about each one to teach one. I learned from both of you gentlemen tonight and hopefully in the very near future we can all grow together in this world of MMA, kickboxing, and combat sports. Yeah, we look, I, look, I personally look forward to working with you again as well, Larry, in the future. Well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give you my phone so you can put down your number because I definitely want to stay in touch with you, Larry. We want to get you in the studio. We want to get you in the studio, Larry. Larry Legend. Uh, it's, it's, I've worked with a lot of great people. Larry is uh, one of the special ones, I'll tell you that. That's it for our show, ladies and gentlemen. This is Sports on the Go One, King Stan MMA, Carol Marks, Kyle Carroll, and our co host, Larry Legend, saying good night. Good night, everybody.